Today we've had a very lovely day with Kay, Alex and Fabio. We really like it and the kids too, we are very happy. We're using art to change the lives of kids, the lives of people, of uh, the leaders of tomorrow. The bag as well from Kai. I really like it because it's yeah, it's black. I can put it on in dress. <laughs> yeah, and I really like the company as well. So I'm looking forward to work with her. <laughs> yeah. I'm Babidi Dorin. I work with Rollout the Barrel Trust. I'm the senior representative for Uganda. And I'm also happy for our other partners. Thumbs up for Uganda, together with Diversity Matters. I very much think and I know that Diversity Matters can do great in our communities because in the rural areas I work in, an issue and we still have it, where a woman is moving around with her, her children just because they are albinos, the society has failed to accept these children, they are calling them ghosts, they are calling them small gods, others want to take them to, uh, for sacrifices so that they get money. So all those these misconceptions can uh, come to an end once we get together and do that great work of diversity matters, whereby communities are going to come and appreciate other communities. Tribes will come and appreciate other tribes. Cultures will come and in, in, in make intermarriages or appreciate other cultures. Diversity matters. Yes, we can. My name is Nantumbe Farida. We are going to use our local language as I interpret in English. So, kati tubuli kuka tunuava na ba nchichi mbere nchichi yata ndi kila wale bili bicha. Chicho aneta zoku yamba. Obuzi buzi buzi sing kani wat challenges are you meeting? How would you need our help or support? And how did this uh, story begin? 
things haven't been easy. Mm. Uh, since when I gave back to the first albino, until the fourth one, I've been moving that miserable life. They need everything. That is the problem. Do the children want to say something? That I would like people to find us a place to settle. Uh huh. I want to go back to school. Kato, mm. you tell us something. She said one day I got there. That I also want to go back to school. Mm. Joan, Joan and tell us something. Eh? <laughs> you ask John once that you want solar. solar energy, solar, you're <laughs> tired of the darkness, but she's right. Next time when you have a bigger space, then we can get more hospital next time. Yeah. Yes, so this is it. We are at the line of the equator and um, I've seen this in many documentaries so it's great to be here and um, stay tuned for more. It started, I will say, four years ago, but it kicked off this year. After three days, I am happy to announce that we finally found a school to register the girls, and we can leave all of them in Kitale and go back to Nairobi and raise more funds to put more girls to school. Well, my name is Mapach. I just come from Kakuma with a gun in Rivijike. I am the one who brought the gun to cut works freedom. My name is Armstrong Tall. I'm a photographer and a filmmaker. I'm the art director for Art of Freedom. It has been a successful two days trying to find schools for the girls and eventually we have. That's the best part of the project that when you see the final intention, not, not the, really the final but the bigger part, picture of having girls go to school, is being achieved. That is the best part of the day. Right now we're putting five girls to school and it's not enough. We're getting a lot of phone calls from girls that need the sponsorship. But we don't have enough funds, we only have the five girls. My name is Munikada. I'm 17 years old. The father died, so I want to get them to be strong. That's why I'm going to school. My name is Monica. I am 18 years old. I am so Sudan. I want to be a teacher. My name is Akwad. I'm 18 years old. I want to go to school in the next class. My name is 
My name is Abu. I am 18 years old. I want to be a lawyer. I start school in primary school. Thank you. We cannot wait to go back home and we have more work to do ahead of us. Beautiful, that's what's up. People, please, don't you see? I'm a Southern Sudanese, I'm Keji. Hi, I'm Jamas Murray. I'm the principal for Boy Girls High here in West Pocot. The idea of Catwalk to Freedom program for the girls is a brilliant idea because the girls really need a chance in, a, you know, in life. And uh, having been rescued in such kind of a hardship kind of a background, and uh, just bringing them here to be in a, in a safe place, I think it's, it's really, really good. I hope that they get enough support and any people out there who are willing to help them, go for it. They have a brilliant future. I believe in them. I've worked with them and they've excelled. So these girls, I still can still do it. They can make it. Just go out there and help them, please. All the state people, please, don't you see? I'm a Southern Sudanese I am dark, I am beautiful, that's what's up People please, don't you see I'm a Southern Sudanese I'm Keji, I'm a Chol, I'm Nyabich, I'm Nyanwer Darling please, don't you see I'm a Southern Sudanese It's not upon my tribe it's not about my height, it's not about my color, it's not about it all, it's not about my height. Hello, my name is Fabio, my name is Martis, name is Pianist Without Borders. Here we are in Uganda and we are at the end of our tour with Kai, Annette, thumbs up for Uganda. And we did an amazing tour. We, we toured uh, many orphanage schools. They helped with Roll at the Barrel, University Matter, and Heart for Change. All of us together we, we managed to help a lot of people. So I thank everybody to, for your support. Thank you for all the people who donate and then believe in, in, in this tour. So thank you very much and we will come back again to continue this tour and help other people.